Good day, my beautiful people. Is your girl Chili Living Signature? How are you guys doing? Thank you, friends, for subscribing to my channel. Thank you, friends, for your likes. Thank you for your views. Thank you for sharing my videos. Please, if you are new to my channel, please click on the subscribe button there and also click on notification button. So, when we upload a new video, you will get notified. Please, please, God bless you. I love you all. So, in our today's class, I'll be showing you guys how to cut and stitch a front twist eh, dress now we have dropped out our basic bodies eh, pattern so if you look at it very well you can see that there's another line there this second line this is a accurate body measurement the standard body measure we are working with but we i can in this line i see we are going to reduce it because we are working with a stretchy fabric is polo stretches so we don't want that swaying it to not be fitted so i have to remove one inch from your arm all side to your full length of your dress when you are done with that come to your hip line remove mark and half inch blend it downward to your full length of your dress and to your waist line you and see what i've done it already take a look at it is in two folds so we want to quickly cut it out guys so guys can you see we've cut it out so now we can remove it and open it because it's into four see how pretty it is looking already see how pretty it is looking already so guys from the way this is your waist uh, waistline this is our hip line but from the waistline we have to go up by two inches yes or to go by two inches so this now become the new now we're working with from these two inches upward from the two inches upward this is the midpoint of the dress you can see it so you mark three inches away from there a fine can you see three inches away from the midpoint of the front uh, bodies can you see it i've done that so when you are done with that uh, you come to your arm you will measure two and a half inches i come to your hip line can you guys see it your hip line here yeah? you go upward by three inches you draft it join it together so i've joined it guys so you will come to your arm on this side quickly mark two inches from your arm or downward two inches but at this point you are going to drop direct from your hip line take a straight line ruler and join it right away so guys, we are done join to the on the hip down to the point and it came down by three inches also. We have joined this. It's now the time to mark a slit opening. Yes, but before then we have to label it on can number it. show you guys so i'm done it's open can you see this is the upper side see why it's very important to label it this is a this is a b this is c and this is a the d part i don't know why you guys can see it the d part of it so now we want to transfer it to our interfacing if you're not using interfacing then transfer it under brown paper yes or white paper my brown paper is not available so i want to transfer it to white paper but brown paper sorry but while transferring it you have to check your label now i have to a and c first so i have to remove the rest and place a and c together 
So let's see how it's going to look, guys. When we are done, guys, this is how it's going to look. This is A and uh, C together. That what some are going to do to. That's what sorry. Some are going to do to D and uh, B. But if you look at this end part, look at it, guys. There is an half inch for your joining to your waist. There's an half inch. Make sure that it match it. It match it. The last slit opening matches with the last slit opening on the both side. But for the um, arm O side, add an half inch. Your joint allowance, half inch here. Your joint allowance also, which is here. It's already done here. Yeah? Let me show you guys. It's joint allowance. Look at it. It's already added. Your shoulder part add an half inch. So let's quickly cut out the D and B also. So guys, we have done the same thing from the D and B. Look at the waistline and half inch was also added to join to the waistline. You can we see how pretty? Okay, stick to the table so guys. How pretty is looking already. This is the bottom part of the dress. This is the upper side of the dress. Can you see? So let me show you guys how we're going to stitch it to form our twist. Um, gown front twist gown. So see, let's go. Well, the stitches, guys, we have to start with the down part of the dress, the hip side, which is our D and B together. So you see, guys, you flip it over this way now. Flip it over. Flip it over. Let me see. Let me bring it close to the camera. I've done that. So we want to stitch, but before we stitch, we should. Um, we give a space of one inch yes an inch of opening where we are going to insert the upper part of our dress to get it twisted so i want to pick the sewing machine and stitch from here down to the end it in to get our dress twisted So guys, our picture is looking already. Can you see? Can you see? This will be joined to this side. This will be joined to this part. Then we have already joined this. This is the first one that we did. I don't know if you guys can see it properly. That we left an inch opening. So we we'll join these two, this. But before then, you can secure it with your straight line pin by flipping over. See what I'm doing, guys. Right side facing the right side. You turn it this way. Right side facing the right. Uh, side you secure it as well in this way right side facing the right side then you see we click I want to quickly take to my sewing machine to stitch this people are stitching here. We have already secured it here. We are stitching here close. We have already secured it here. The same here, but we've secured it here. So while stitching, flip over and follow those lines. Let me do that and show you guys. So guys, machine to stitch, but we have to flip over. Let me show you guys how you stitch it. From here to this place. Over, so you guys can see, see how pretty it's looking. 
our front twist dress is ready thank you guys thank you guys for watching my video if you enjoy my video please click on the like button there comment share my video i love you guys god bless you all thank you all bye